Hello guys, my name is Ismas and welcome to another Blender giveaway. Uh, so I did, uh, I just modded uh, this asset here. Uh, it's not what I'm giving away. Let me make sure that I turn this off, simplify so that I have a better resolution. Uh, so I modded this asset here uh, that I'm selling on uh, CG Trader. Uh, but uh, I want to give away the materials uh, that I used here. Let me go to layer because I think it shows uh, the lighting and the textures better. Uh, let me get a different uh, background image, lighting image here. So yeah, uh, I modeled this a few hours ago and uh, let me also first turn off uh, this, uh, what is it? Uh, I made occlusion so that uh, the screen is not laggy. Yeah, so yeah, I've just made this asset a few hours ago. Uh, so yeah, what I'm going to be giving away for free is uh, the materials that I used on this asset. Uh, so uh, this kind of, uh, I don't know how to call it, but uh, yeah, that material there, uh, the brush metal here, uh, this glass reflective, yeah, reflective glass. And uh, yeah, so let's take a look at them. Uh, so you can see what I'm giving away this time. So they don't, they don't really look much when you're just looking at the spheres here themselves, but uh, you can see how they have been applied onto an asset and how uh, they, make, they make the asset look uh, realistic. So uh, this here, I changed it a bit and uh, you can see it's this material here and it's also the same material here. Uh, if we go to the shader, I've set it up in a way that uh, you can easily change the color. So if you see this color freshener, it uses hue and saturation uh, let me make sure I have, have that selected. You can see you can use this hue and saturation or hue just uh, to change uh, the color of that uh, light. So you can see uh, same principle with this, uh, with this blue uh, ring there. And uh, yeah, so uh, for this here, um, I'm using some, I'm using this gauge here or cage, whatever you want to call it. And if you want to make those, uh, that texture look more pronounced, you just increase uh, the bump map here. And uh, you can also change, play around with the metallic uh, option here to see how that changes uh, the look. I haven't tried it in different colors, but I think it should work, it should still work properly so you can see. Yeah, so yeah, so that's uh, those are the materials I'm giving away this time. Obviously, you can download them on my Patreon page. Uh, it's not going to be for paid patrons. It's for free. Anyone who has access to, to the link, they can easily download uh, these materials. Uh, so, but if you have, if you can, please do support uh, my Patreon page, and uh, that's why I'm able to continue doing this for you guys. Uh, so yeah, you will, you will find this in the link. I uh, just go to the links, be, the link below of this video, and uh, you should be able to find. Uh, you should be able to download uh, these materials. Uh, last time I gave away, I think the warm metal shaders, uh, but uh, this time I was mostly focused on uh, the electric or non-metal, non-metallic shaders, uh, with the exception of this uh, brushed metal, uh, which I used on this area here so if you look closely you can see that's a brushed metal yeah so uh let me make sure that uh, every texture that i i use here because i use some image textures here uh to get that detail in it's not just procedural textures because our pr procedural textures are very nice but uh, they can be very computer intensive uh, so sometimes if you can't get away with using just an image with with using uh, an image i uh, do use that as well uh, because if you if I try to close this and reopen it, you can see how long it would take uh, to load uh, that uh, that project. Uh, simply because uh, I have some node setups that I have there uh, to you can see okay, because I think I opened this already. It's it's not taking that long. But uh, if you only have if you have a lot of nodes in your shaders, uh, they usually take longer uh, to to calculate or compile. Uh, that's why if you can get away with using with uh, using just uh, animate texture like uh, what I did here, uh, you can use that to 
kind of reduce the computation power of your PC uh, that is required to process the shaders. Uh, so yeah, you can find the, the link to these uh, materials in the description and I'll be making more uh, giveaways like this, free giveaways to all my subscribers. Uh, yeah, so make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and uh, also if you can, uh, do support my Patreon page, uh, which you can find at uh, patreon.com forward slash top channel one on one. Otherwise, thank you for watching and I'll see you later. <laughs>